Ladies and gentlemen, I've been waiting to say this to you for three long years. We are fishing opening day in Ontario on Eagle Lake. What's going on everybody? My name is Brian, you're watching Angling Anarchy, and we finally get to fish the opener on Eagle Lake again. Two years of COVID um, kept us from doing it, and we're back, so uh, couldn't be more excited. We've got strange conditions. The water is at least three feet high on Eagle Lake, so there are a lot of rocks. Eagle Lake is already scary enough. There are rocks that used to be above water that are now underneath water and could end the trip uh, very tragically, so we have to be really careful out here this year. We've got a lot of the stuff marked, but we've got mid to upper 50 degree water temps. Jim and I went out back there. Look at that, Jim's, where'd he go? There he is, he's down there. <laughs> but uh, Jim and I went out last night. We got here last night to Cold Grove's Eagle Lake Lodge and went out, caught some pike, had a blast doing that, picked up some walleyes, just throwing rattle traps and that sort of thing. Uh, and just checking out weed growth. It's not very far along. Uh, the water temps are a little bit cool. Uh, we saw anywhere from 57 to 62. We've got kind of a brisk southeast wind today. So those are the conditions. I'm gonna stop yapping and rambling here. I'm so excited to get out back on Eagle Lake in the spring and see if we can catch a muskie. Fish. Oh boy. Okay. Huh? Okay, <laughs> keep that pressure on him. Okay. Oh, got him, Jim. Who? Who? Yes! <laughs> oh. 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 <laughs> oh. I think that's a mid upper 40s probably. That's a nice fish. We'll put her on spot lock and take care of him. <laughs> All right, folks, we got Jim's fish. We're gonna take a quick look at it. What a beautiful Eagle Lake muskie. 48 and a half, we already got it on the bump. So, all right, let's get her back. <laughs> all right, girl. Terrible, though. You got it. Well, I wanted the shoulder guy to give me a shot. Until we figured out what was going on. Really yeah. Yeah. First started, I don't think it was. I thought maybe it was a, a pike or something. <laughs> well, look at that. That's that's a big fish, man. That's a, that's a freaking dandy. That's a way to start the trip off. A little better than the 22 inch last year. There she goes. There she goes. There she goes. Thank you. Thank you, Brian. 
Whoo! <laughs> There, she kicked down. All right. I'm kind of surprised. Not even. Although I've seen them right here in this little corner too. Fish. Just like a nice fish, Jim. Twist there. Okay, I'm gonna. Why well, you want to stand up here? Okay, you ready? There we go. <laughs> All right, I'll just step over it. Or here, here, yep. Two bites, two fish. Wow. That is a little bit of all right. We'll put her on spot lock. Get the bump board ready. Look at that. He just absolutely crushed. That Medusa. All right, buddy, let's get you. Let's get you. Uh, yep, but let me, I'm just gonna. All right, we're gonna have to retie. I'll let you sit in the water there, girl. Regroup here. Let's see what we got here. It's not as big as Jim's, but it's probably a nice, solid, low 40s, scrappy fish. Get her up, bump her quick, and we'll take a look at her. Oh, yeah, look at that. Look at that. She is. 44, stretches right to 44. Just a beautiful, thick Eagle Lake fish. All right, man, a 44 and a 48 and a half. Not a bad way to start off our opener here. Okay, I'll let you go. Thank you for playing. All right, folks, uh, I got so excited to start fishing, I forgot to tell you what I was using today. A mid-medusa. I got a one-ounce deep threat weight just to get the get her down there a little bit. And I'm throwing it on a 2020 Assault Stick Shock and Awe with a 500 Tranks. What's Jim tossing? Let's take a look at it. We got to see the bait that got the big fish so far. Look at that. Shocking, I know. Eagle, black and gold. This is a six and three quarter Custom X Mini X. And Jim's throwing it on a 2020 Surgical Strike with a wrong-handed 401 Tranks. That's what we got. And uh, so far it seems to be working pretty good. just probably 30 yards to the right of where I cast there. Oh, oh, that's a big fish, Jim. That is a big fish. Yeah, yeah, keep going. You got him, you got him, you got him. That's all right, that's all right. Just keep the, keep the tension on him. I don't think he's as big as we thought no, at first, but he's, he's a nice fish. He really looks good yeah. when he come in. Yeah, there you go. There you go. Oh, she thinks she's big. You want me to tighten the drag? How's she feel? Go ahead, there you go, there you go. 
There you go. A little more, there we go. Yeah, that's, boy, I looked down at first and I, I, thought, I, I thought you had a 50 incher there, Jim. <laughs> I think it was the way it just it came yeah. up. It just it looked like a, a giant. Holy crap! <laughs> That's probably just a solid forty inch. <laughs> uh, we're a little excited. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> oh man, that was fun though. Yeah, the the way she turned on the yeah. figure, I looked down and she was just on that bait, man. I'm gonna get the spot lock going here, and we will take care of this fish. There we go. All right, here we go, Jim's <laughs> second fish of the day. Another beautiful Eagle Lake muskie. Got some spawning scars. There's more on the backside. But uh, yeah, what do you think, Jim? All right. <laughs> yeah, I'll say all That's right. That's a good start. It is. All right, there we go. Just, we got her. Just, we got her. I don't know if I'm overly protective of that. Oh yeah, look at those. Arm, but boy, that thing went it. The spawn scars on the side there. Yeah. Yeah, she's got a little, she's been beat up, but definitely done doing their thing. There she goes, kicking away strong, cold water, so not too hard on them. Net again. <laughs> I like that nut. <laughs> All right, well, uh, I, I looked down at my GoPro when I stopped it after Jim caught his fish, and it was two minutes since I talked about what we were using. Apparently, eagle color works on eagle. Black and gold has always been really good for us that I've had really good luck on an 8 inch Custom X Mini X on that, that black and gold eagle color pattern. Jim's using the 6 and 3 quarter. Uh, like I said, that, that surgical strike, the 9 foot surgical strike, does a really nice job of handling that bait. Um, won't rip the hooks out when you got a fish running. So, man, this is, so, this is fantastic. I, <laughs> it's almost like it's bad luck to do this good on the first day, but I hope I won't say anything. We'll, let's just keep fishing and get another one. All right, well, that wraps up what was an absolutely lovely morning of musky fishing and an absolutely terrible afternoon. Um, we only saw two fish this afternoon. A little rough, but we were doing uh, some reconnaissance, trying to figure out uh, maybe some other places these fish could be or not be, and we mostly found out where they were not being. So, yeah, we got six more days of this ridiculousness. Uh, we're tired. We've still got a little bit of light to fish, but um, three fish day, uh, I'm, I'm okay with that. And they were all quality fish, 48 and a half, 44, 42, and uh, saw a couple others. So we are going to wrap this up, go back in, chill out, get some rest, and do it all again tomorrow. So thank you everyone for watching. I appreciate every single one of you, and I'll see you in the next video.